Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. Today I'm going to show you a couple yard sale finds. Uh, one's a yard sale find and one's a, a free stuff. But I'm going to throw it in one video because it's going to be a quick video. Also, I have some news for you about what me and Monkey are going to be doing. So stick around and I'll tell you all about that. Okay guys, before I take you outside and show you what I got, uh, not this weekend, but next weekend, um, Monkey and I are going on a camping trip. Okay, we're only going to be gone for two days and two nights. Uh, we're going to be going Saturday, Sunday, and we'll come back Monday. So, kind of like three days but uh two nights so we already have i've already reserved the place we're going and we're going to a a campground uh where they have tent camping and they also uh we can bring our own boat they have a ramp there they have docks there um the name of the place is i'm going to put it across the screen right now because I can't pronounce it <laughs> I, but anyway it'll go across the screen but that's where we're going if you guys want to check it out it's about 35 minutes from here it's still in our county though it's in in Citrus County Florida so but uh, we were watching some YouTube videos and and a couple that had this you know $250,000 RV motorhome was talking about how oh I'm glad that they separate the tent area from the RV area because the tenters make so much noise you know what if you you, you know if you're gonna just sit in your damn RV all day long yeah I got something to say about that if you're gonna sit in your RV all day long why even why even leave all you know is flexing your fucking money number one and number two you know yeah heaven forbid if these tenters are out um, congregating by a fire and enjoying life and maybe having a couple drinks and, and laughing and joking yeah heaven forbid if they would do that besides I'm glad too that I don't need to hear your fucking air conditioner and your fucking uh, generator running to run that air conditioner all night long too so kiss my ass anyway that ran out of the way I just fucking hate people like that think they're better than anybody else because oh I got this motorhome you're not camping if you're in a fucking motorhome and you stay in there all goddamn day unless you're going out renting kayaks because you know why why, why not buy your own because you, you just want to rent other people's stuff you know why why even leave the house anyway that just pisses me off I took that the wrong way and so did monkey you know like oh because they're tank campers they're no good yeah right anyway so let's go outside it's just a couple little things um, like I said I, I mainly uh, uh, want to do this video to let you know if we have any kind of service there I'll try to do a live stream but we're going to spend the day boating and fishing and then the evening we're going to you know cook monkeys some good grub on the on the fire and um you know we're going to bring you guys along with that so i doubt if i'll be able to get anything um posted uh because of the the internet service but I'll break it up into a couple different parts and that way when I get back you'll have a couple things to watch so anyway let's go outside and check this out okay guys here's the first thing I got uh, it's only a 32 pound thrust but uh, ours is uh, 55 but I didn't buy this for this boat Although I may put it in the boat as a spare. But the guy says, when you run it, it will like stop 
it'll just stop working and you tap on this it'll start working again so there's something loose up in here which i did try out and that's exactly what it does okay um it is a Minn Kota. that's my favorite trolling motor but i bought it at five dollars on it i asked him what was wrong with it he told me i said hell for five bucks can't go wrong because that prop to me is worth five bucks mount here to me is worth five bucks these ends to me are worth five bucks so you know and whatever other wires you know if i decide to strip it down but this could be a late night video tomorrow night so and if it works good then i may just stuff it under the seat one of the seats and keep it for a spare or i may sell it or i don't know this would be perfect for a like a little canoe you know uh, something like that it wouldn't push this along very well but in an emergency i think you know it would help so i don't know what this is they've got tape over this for some reason there's a hole there but it's an older one i figured like i said for five bucks what the hell right now let's get to the free thing so a couple weeks ago we were i went to the yard sale off the road and they had these speakers sitting out i didn't even ask about them because they have been wet okay we went back that night to take Bruno for a ride. We went up the street to take Bruno for a ride, and these were sitting out for free. So I grabbed them. Now, I don't know if they work. This is going to be another thing we're going to check out together. Um, like I said, they, they have been wet, so the cases are kind of screwed up. But I figured for free anything a good switch I can use I can use that I can use these things but as you can see they've been wet so we're gonna try them though and see if they work what the hell right and if they work maybe I'll hook them up to the music in the garage but yeah I seen that were free and I seen them switches on the back I thought what the hell right so yeah, that's them. But I figure what I'm probably going to do, what is that, Century? What I'm probably going to do is take these things out. And that's going to be that, you know? So, anyway, hook them up in here. I do have a stereo that works in this thing. My stereo works well. All right. Let's head back in the garage and shoot the crap for a minute and then I'll let you guys go. I just want to let you know about that. Um, listen, I don't know because of the crows. I don't know if you can hear this or not. That's the ring doorbell going off. I didn't snooze it, so monkey's phone's probably going nuts. Her and her mom had to go to the bank and to the store. Look at the sky, beautiful. Not a cloud in the sky. Well, there's a cloud, but it's not a rain cloud. So, and it's been getting down in the 60s. So it's going to be a great time camping next weekend. So, can't wait to bring you guys along. Um... We're going to take the boat out Saturday, this Saturday. We're going to check it out, make sure everything's good to go on it. Make sure everything's up to par. I want to check the oil in the lower unit, the lube in there. What you do is you take this out here, and then you take this top one out, and you squirt your your uh, lubricant up inside until it comes out there and there's your oil level so this one 
I don't know what that little hole there was for. I've never seen one of that hole. Probably a vent. But anyway, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to check this out. Let's go in the garage. Okay, guys, so there you go. Just a quick upload for you. Mainly, what I, I'll still put this video under the free stuff uh, playlist and under the garage sale find playlist. Um, but I mainly wanted to let you know about the camping trip coming up. <clears throat> um, we did buy a new tent because our tents are just too big for what we're going to be doing. Uh, like I said, I'm going to keep one. I'm going to sell one. But the one I keep will be more for like a four or five day adventure. So we just went and bought a little six person tent, which will be just fine for us and our gear. You know, the two of us and our gear. So that should be all we need. I think it's an Ozark Trail. Um, but anyway, it should be okay for what we're gonna what we're gonna be doing. It does have the uh, the netting on the top, so you can look up and see the stars. If it rains, it's got a rain fly too. So anyway, like I said, just mainly wanted to to let you know uh, what was going on and to kind of share those couple little items with you. Um. And then, I think that's about it for now. Stay tuned for more boating videos. The water is just so high for fishing. That's why fishing has been better. Um, although I have not fished down here, but everybody's saying the same thing. The river's just too high because usually, you know, they're pulling gar and mudfish out of there left and right, but and catfish. Just the water's too high. And it's, so when the water gets high, then, you know, the... The big fish will get back in into the wood wooded areas and back in there and um, so stay tuned for more fishing videos uh, from the boat that way we can get back in some different places I just thought I'd go out and try it out a little bit so I've caught some fish so down here in Florida you know I'm gonna be able to fish all year so that'll be cool so anyway guys thanks for watching appreciate it uh, weekends weekend's coming up October's here I'm not sure what we're going to do for Halloween yet last year I think uh, what was it we went to that cemetery did a live stream uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do uh, but I'm going to come up with something for you guys to watch and uh, maybe a live stream I don't know yet we'll find out I'll talk to monkey and see what she's got in mind and we'll go from there so anyway guys have a safe and happy weekend tomorrow's friday so it's pretty much here today's you know uh it's about noon time so yeah it is noon so anyway guys have a good one be safe and y'all take care we'll chat soon bye bye shea bear the myth the man legend i'm gone for now bye bye guys take care